today I'm having something delicious uh, from Caginos. Yeah, Caginos, Italian pizzeria and deli. Um, I have a Sicilian style baked ziti. It looks very cheesy and delicious. Um, I have a caprese salad because I was craving it. And an antipasto misto, which is basically just um, like marinated vegetables, like, like, so I almost said some dried tomatoes. It's uh, roasted red peppers, um, and marinated olives. <laughs> this is the marinated olives. This is marinated mushrooms. Duh. Um, and then there's pepperoni, salami, and obviously lots of pepperoncini peppers, mozzarella, and I'm thinking this is a different type of mozzarella. Like a more firm mozzarella? I'm not sure. Mmm, <laughs> could be Parmesan. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Definitely Parmesan. It's very soft, though. Hmm. Mmm, very soft and fresh. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Okay. Mmm. I wanted to start with the caprese, mm, which is tomatoes, fresh mozzarella, basil, and wow, it looks like it has like garlic spread over the top of it, and red pepper flakes. And I have something under it to kind of lift it up so y'all could see it, but y'all see it. <laughs> So I'm gonna move that just because. Mm. Put that there. Okay, cuz I've got this balsamic vinaigrette. Well, it's not even a vinaigrette, it's just. Mm. Okay. It's just balsamic vinegar and oil, I believe. Oh, and there's a lot of it, and I'm just gonna dump it. Cause I like the taste of balsamic. Mmm. Yummy. Alrighty. Put the spoon over here. And um thing I'll, I'll say about Kajinos is they're definitely going for um <laughs> what do you call it? Um sustainable packaging. This I believe is like sustainable plastic. And so is this. And these babies right here, um, they're good for saving. Uh, I'll be saving them and using them in my kitchen. Okay, let's get some tomato and basil and a bite. Oh, my goodness. Mm. Actually, I'm going to cut up a couple pieces. Yes. Mmm. Some mozzarella, tomato, basil. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's so pretty. Mmm. Mmm. That is beautiful. Mmm. 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 I adore the taste of fresh basil. Mmm. Oh, yes. Mmm. So, I just finished my book today. It was a Stephen King fairy tale. And I really liked it. Mmm. 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 It may not be the absolute best Stephen King story I've read, but, or listened to in this case, but I did enjoy it quite a lot. Mmm. Mmm. 
I'm already preparing myself for my next book. <laughs> I was like, yes. This is going to be my new favorite thing to do. Is uh, listening to audiobooks. You know, reading is like a hobby. And although I have lots of books, you know, I just never take the time. And for me, I guess it's just easier to, you know, listen on my phone. Hmm. Get up there. Mmm. 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 Oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A little olive, and I'm pretty sure it's got seeds. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, those are good. Good olive. Oh, there's several different kinds of olives. Mmm. 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 Oh, I love them. It's a green one. Mmm. Mmm. some really good extra virgin olive oil down there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm. Have a nap because the door. Dang it. Oh, it's just coated in the olive oil. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Uh, mm. Mm -hmm. That's the same mozzarella. Mm. Oh my goodness. That is beautiful. Mm -hmm. I have a cheese salad. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. The mozzarella <clears throat> kind of soaked up the balsamic. Mmm. So the next book on my agenda is uh, Anne Rice, Prince Lestat. That's where I am in the Vampire Chronicles and series. Mm. Mm. I'm very much looking forward to it. Mm. I'm gonna sop up some of that. Balsamic juice. Mm. 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 Oh, yeah. Mm. 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 Okay. Before I go too far. Mm. Let me see about my ziti. Mm. 
Ooh. Ooh. Uh, yes, indeed. Super cheesy. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, Lord have mercy, that's good. Mm. Mm. Oh, it's hot. Mm. I've never had the ziti from uh, Kijinos before. I believe I've had the fettuccine. <clears throat> but not the ziti. Mmm. 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 Oh, man. It's just coated and it's not like the ricotta is not like just clumped on there but it's all through the sauce so it's like every bite is like loaded down with cheesiness and then there's the mozzarella baked on top even mmm 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 My go-to pasta dish is typically a lasagna, you know, and then of course the fettuccine alfredo and then a the spaghetti. But recently I kind of, I thought about it and baked ziti tends to have ricotta in it. It's like a lasagna. This sauce isn't a meat sauce. It does taste a bit meaty though, even though I'm not really like catching chunks of meat in it. But it's freaking delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my word, that's good. Mm. Oh, and it's steaming. I don't know if y'all can see the steam. Mmm. Mm. Wow. Oh my gosh. Let's see. Mm. 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 Went from the hot pasta to a cold mushroom. Mm. Marinated mushrooms are delicious. Mm. Mm. I love those shrooms. Mm. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Let me see.
Mm -hmm. Go away, you silly little gnat. Dang it. I got it. I got it. Mmm. Okay. that hunk of mozzarella oh excuse me already burping oh, let's see. Oh. Mm. 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 Lot of Stephen King books that I haven't read. And the last newer Stephen King books I've read were probably in the early 2000s. The last one I can really remember was the final book in the Dark Tower series, which is an excellent series kind of, in my opinion, you know, Stephen King's, like, opus. <coughs> it was, like, a huge series. Mm. Oh. There's such a <sighs> richness in his works because it's like he's he's literally created this entire universe and all of his stories even under his pseudonym pseudonym not pseudonym pseudonym Richard Bachman the stories still tie together somewhere in some way or another mm. Mm. And I know it exists. Mm. But I would love to have the chart that shows where all of Stephen King's stories like interact, you know. How the characters interact or if, you know, story how just how stories are related. I love it. Mm. mm. Mmm. Tart and spicy and delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. 
But yeah, Stephen King is like one of my top, top favorite authors ever. I just love his work. I just love his work. Um, Anne Rice, she's way up there. She's way up there. And I also, um, I used to love Cloud Barker's books. But like Anne Rice, sometimes he kind of delved away from like the horror type. Or just not necessarily just horror, but just the previous style of, of books. And I was, I'm sure he's gone back, you know, or I'm sure he's, he's written, you know, horror and fantasy type stories since, but... another little one see that's what I get yeah, for, for leaving my door open mm. but it's just easier for me mm. 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 this right here this is snacking for a couple of days. I'm gonna tell you right now. Mm. Mm. Or at least today and tomorrow, definitely. Cause that's a lot of freaking cheese and meat. That is a lot <laughs> to eat some pepperoni. And this is like the large pepperoni, I believe. Or it could just be another kind of salami. That's more than likely. Mmm. Mmm. Yes. Yeah. Can't eat all of this at one sitting. I will swell up. Oh, my feet will swell up like a balloon. Mmm-hmm. Most definitely. Mmm. Okay, I don't think I've tried this kind of olive. It's more like torpedo shaped. Mmm. 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 Gosh. All good. Oh, those are even saltier than normal. Woo! Woo hoo hoo. Okay. <laughs> I see this one's a similar color, but it's round. Mm. Oh, man. Wow. Those sorts of things make me really happy. You know, olives and meats and cheese and roasted bell peppers mushrooms i'm gonna have one more of these little peppers and i say little i'm gonna take a little one watch this one be hot <laughs> so much hot but packed <laughs> packed with seeds though Woo! <laughs> okay I want to go back to my my ziti oh mm. oh Fabulous. Mm. Wow. 
Mm. Oh my gosh. The ZD's making me so happy right now. What is it about pasta? Ooh. Mm. 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 Oh my God. Oh. Mm. Oh. Ooh, I don't know how I get so full so fast. Man. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. Oh, my word. Oh. Mm. <clears throat> Mm. I've almost eaten half though. Almost. Mm. <coughs> mm. Mm. Dang it. Okay, y'all. I'm reaching the end of my rope here. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh. I've nibbled at this pretty well. There's still quite a lot there. I have a little bit of my caprese left. And <laughs> slightly bit over half of my CD, but I'm running out of room for dessert. <laughs> mm. And I have dessert. Oh my god. Oh. 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 The pasta hit rock bottom. Oh goodness. Mm. Okay. Going to move the caprese out of the way and show y'all this beautiful thing here. It is a tiramisu. And these folks gave me an actual I do believe that's class, but it, 
it's like cold <laughs> it's cold like glass oh goodness I don't know I don't... it could be a really hard plastic but it kind of feels like glass but it's like a tiramisu dessert cup and I'm about to to dig in Mm. Oh my goodness. Oh, beautiful. Mmm. Mmm. Creamy mascarpone shoes, mascarpone. Mm. Oh. The coffee liqueur in there. Just that coffee flavor is so good. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So basically. This isn't some frozen tiramisu that they just, I mean, it's very cold, so very well they may have frozen these, but I'm pretty dang sure they must make these in-house. Oh my gosh. Mmm. 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 Wow, that is nice. Mm. Man, it makes me want to order more. <laughs> I have a little set of dessert cups. So, man, the sustainable packaging goes above and beyond. I gotta give, I gotta give it to Kajinos. That's pretty awesome. Mm. Oh my gosh. That's delicious. But I am so full right now. Oh, <laughs> full and happy and fat. I'm very fat. And I have leftovers. And I will be snacking tonight. <laughs> uh, I may actually eat the rest of this for dinner. Mmm. But if eating by eating this for dinner, I'll be able to keep my hands off of all of this. Cause, uh, yeah, fatty me would love to eat every bite of that. But I know my body would be very angry, very very angry to eat all of the all of the meat. The cheese maybe not so much, but I can't eat a whole lot of like salami. Mmm. Although it's like my favorite lunch meat. <laughs> it really is. Mmm. 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 All right, stop it, Candy. Mmm. Finishing up with the taste of dessert in my mouth. Finishing up with the taste of meat. Oh, that was spicy. Mmm. That's probably Capicola. I wouldn't even know. But it might be. I have no idea. Anyway, you guys, I love you very much. <clears throat> wow. Thank you for spending some time with me today. Um, it's my birthday week. My next video should be me enjoying a nice big juicy steak. That's what I'm looking forward to. Um, I'm actually, I still haven't gotten my Whole Foods order. Um, I need to do that at some point very soon. Mm, but the day got away from me today, so. Uh, 
I mean, I could get it, I could get it delivered anytime. You know, it's not that late, but, you know, I just don't want to, like, double up or whatever. And I was craving some freaking ziti. So, here we are. <laughs> anyway, love you guys. Thank you so much for being with me today. And I will see you next time. Bye now. <laughs>